Hey, how's it going, guys? This is Kill Logue, and I hope that your day is going well. Whatever you happen to be up to so far in the day, I hope that it's going by pretty smoothly and that you're in a good mood and you're pretty excited for a, I don't know, de pretty decent gameplay. Not the best. Uh, as for me, I'm feeling a lot better today. The past couple of days, I worked really early and I just felt drained, felt really dead, didn't get a lot of sleep, just hate being sleep deprived and just trying to, I don't know, go about my day without, you know, feeling as good as I should be, you know? Because whenever I, I don't know about you guys, but I don't operate the best whenever I'm exhausted. I mean, I can still do things, but I won't be quite as enthusiastic as I am right now, I guess you could say, and I just don't enjoy life at all as much whenever I'm exhausted. Uh, yesterday I worked 8 to 5 and the day before that I only worked from 10 to 7 but I thought that I came in at 8 my friend uh, that works back there with me told me I came in at 8 so I showed up there at 8 o'clock ended up just going home and went back to take a little hour nap and I just felt like shit both of those days pretty much and yesterday I started to go out with a couple of friends and I hung out for a couple of hours but I just ended up going back home and just went to sleep pretty much at midnight woke up at let's see like 10 o'clock a.m. and I went straight back to sleep I had like a little bit to eat a little bit of breakfast went straight back to sleep and slept until like 3 o'clock and I felt a lot better after that guys just a little pro tip in real life don't ever try to go about uh, you know every day without getting enough sleep it's just not worth it you know life is a lot more enjoyable whenever you do have sleep and I know for one thing about the game too as well, I can't play nearly as good whenever I'm half awake. And it's just not as fun. I don't want to play as much. I rage easier. I get mad. or I, I mean, obviously I get mad easier, but I get, you know, kind of depressed like I was talking about in uh, one of the other commentaries because, you know, about how badly I started to hate Modern Warfare 3 and stuff. But enough about that. This game is about to come to a close. I know in just about a week or less, Black Ops 2 is coming out, so hopefully you guys are excited as I am, because pretty much anything that I can post on my YouTube channel that is not Modern Warfare 3, I am very happy with. And not to say that I'm not happy with this gameplay. Alright, let me go ahead and talk about this gameplay since I've been rambling on about real life stuff for the past two and a half minutes. Okay, so, this gameplay is kind of old, like a month or two old, and I liked it because that... I am not running in the spawn or doing anything anything uh, that I didn't used to do normally, you know what I mean? Nowadays, I kind of just rush the spawns a lot and get my team to help me out a little bit here and there. And that helps me to get gameplays, obviously. But in this gameplay, I was playing like I used to play. I used to just, you know, kind of camp outside of the spawn and spawn trap them. And just be a team player. I wasn't flipping the spawns or doing, doing anything like that. And it's funny that I mentioned that because... <laughs> As I see that, I see one of my teammates running right on A spawn, but I don't know, maybe he was a random. But anyways, yeah, I like this gameplay because of that. Even though somebody is running support for me, it's not like I asked them to or they even ran it for me. They probably just ran it for the whole party in general, so that's cool. I, I would do that too, you know, still back then I would run support now and then, and I still do to this day. So just for my party to help everybody out. And to notice in this gameplay, I am flawless right now or actually you probably don't know because I didn't start at the very beginning but I'm like 50 and 0 right now and I managed to get another Reaper and then I die I just completely choke like a couple kills off of the assault MOAB but you know what happens and I just wanted to post this gameplay for another reason that well obviously it's like the last gameplay I had on my hard drive but uh, other than that I wanted to post this gameplay because I've been posting pretty much only ACR tryhard gameplays and this is a bit different, it's a one-shot gun, even though I am using the rapid fire on it, it's a little bit less OP than the ACR. And uh, look at this, me capping the B5 like a boss. Like I said, try to be a little bit of a team player. And hopefully you guys enjoy the switch up in the gameplay. But uh, I didn't have too much of a topic this video. I guess I'll talk a little bit about Black Ops 2 some more and how I feel about the perks and everything like that. I'm really happy with how that they did Ghost where you have to move while it works, but last night I was on Twitter and I noticed somebody uh, was retweeting something, somebody's tweet about Black Ops 2 saying that 
the uh, dogs will only kill you if you're running around. So if you're sitting in a corner like noobs would whenever dogs came Black Ops 1, then dogs are just going to run right past you. They're not even going to pay any attention to you. And oh my god, I'm sorry about this freaking loud ass airplane flying over. I live pretty close to the airport, by the way, guys. And I have both of my windows open because my AC is out right now and my fan on. So hopefully that doesn't uh, bother you guys too much. Hopefully you can't hear it too loud. But anyways, also, you have to be shooting your gun or running around for the dogs to attack you. So you could be camping in the corner, but, you know, somebody goes to rush you and you shoot your gun so you get killed by a dog. You know, say you kill the guy that's camping in a corner. So that doesn't make it too underpowered. But if you think about it, if there's a blackbird in the air while there's dogs out and other kill streaks, you're probably not going to be camping in a corner too much. And if you are, then we're going to be able to find you, my team, that I'm definitely going to be running with when Black Ops 2 comes out. We're going to be able to find you with our blackbirds. And we're just going to rape. You know, we're just going to straight up push your shit in. So. Hopefully camping will not be very effective at all whenever Black Ops 2 comes out because I know it is extremely effective in Modern Warfare 3 and I'm sure all you guys know about that. Don't have to talk too much about that anyways. But uh, yeah, hopefully that uh, I'm really hope that, hoping that Black Ops 2 is a really rush friendly game and that there's nothing too overpowered in the game that just completely ruins it. And I don't know, I, I feel that Treyarch does a lot better of a job of balancing their games out than Modern Warfare 3 does. Like, just the other day I tweeted at Infinity Ward, and I was like, so, <laughs> I was like, I was like, so, in Black Ops, or in Modern Warfare 4, whenever I go on a 12 death streak, am I going to be able to get the Moab? And they were like, uh, <laughs> they were like, this is not confirmed yet. They were like... <laughs> Uh, we can't release any information about our game blah 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 and I was just like straight up trolling them like wow Y'all are that dumb that y'all thought I was being serious and they were like I don't know You should just go look at those tweets right now because it is pretty hilarious if you have a Twitter and whatnot And if you do want to follow me, I will respond to every single tweet or every single thing that you want to uh, ask me about I'm pretty friendly on Twitter overall, and I like to interact with people. It's a lot of fun but the gameplay is pretty much coming to a close, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this uh, quick little 87 and 5. We won the game by like 50 points, so it could have dragged out a little bit longer. But anyways, that's the end of the video, guys. Like the video if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you all tomorrow or the next day. And peace!